the day before St. Patrick's Day, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers hosted a public meeting at Bohemia Manor Regional High School to discuss the future of the Pierce Creek Dredge Disposal Area. The meeting was part of an outreach effort that goes back to 2010. Headed by the Corps' Operation Manager for the CND, Tim Kelly, the outreach effort has a dual purpose. To explain the need to reopen the dredge disposal site and to explain the steps that will be taken to ensure safe drinking water in the vicinity. A study commissioned by the Army Corps and carried out by the U.S. Geological Survey concluded that groundwater in the area has been significantly degraded by the disposal site. Residents of nearby communities are naturally concerned and have raised a host of questions at the St. Patrick's Eve meeting at the high school and at earlier meetings held at Army Corps offices in Chesapeake City. Officials from the Army Corps and from the Maryland Port Administration, which operates the Port of Baltimore, have offered an array of options for addressing the problems. The Army Corps is considering installing a liner beneath the dredge disposal site and constructing a slurry wall between the site and the residential areas. The Corps and the Maryland Port Administration are also studying ways to provide residents with better drinking water. Among the options are drilling deeper wells and linking the community to a public water system elsewhere. The need for the disposal area is clear. Without it, the approaches to the C&D canal cannot be kept open. And without the canal, traffic in and out of the port of Baltimore will be drastically curtailed. The right of nearby residents to safe drinking water is just as clear. 